Hi, I'm Bruce Sublett. I sell flies on the internet as Gulf and Ozark flies. And what I'm going to show you here today is a fly I'm calling the Mini Bunny. It's uh, not a real new fly. Bill Hugel has tied a bunny fly for years. But this has got a little different twist on it. We're going to start off with a size 4 Mustad 7766D hook. And you may say, well, I've never heard of that. Uh, it's a Dura-10 hook that's a little shorter shank than the 3407, and the point's turned in a little bit, so that uh, I think it holds and hooks a little bit better. So we're going to put that in the vise. After we get our thread started, I'm going to take a, just a short piece of white rabbit strip, a zonker strip, and tie on the back of the hook. Now, that's by short, I mean the skin part of it is going to be about three quarters of an inch long. It's a very simple fly to tie, and yet it looks pretty nice. All right, we get our zonker strip wrapped down. Going to add several strands of polar flash to the bottom of the hook. Cut the full length of it off. Double it, cut it in half. When the fly is finished, we'll trim this up a little bit so it won't be quite so ragged looking. Right, what makes this different from the regular bunny fly, which has a collar of, of, uh, of wrapped rabbit, this uses an EP fiber and adramus brush which is a pre-made dubbing brush that uses EP fiber and some very fine mylar strips, so you've got glitter in it. And I'm going to tie that down on top of the hook, advance the thread to the eye, and I'm going to make about four wraps. And every time I wrap, I'm going to make sure that I pull all the fibers to the rear. There's four wraps, come around to the top again, make sure that I pull it back. Because I can't find my pliers, I'm going to cut it right at the very back of my scissors so I don't hurt the part that, that I'd normally use. Okay, the whip finish. Add an eye on each side. These are 532nd inch Mirage Dome eyes, which is just a nice all around bait fish eye because it reflects a lot of different colors. Red also works well, chartreuse is good. And to hold those eyes in place, then I'm going to put Finally, a, a little bit of tough fly on the head to finish it. This is tough fly finish, which always stays clear. It penetrates well and just makes good heads for small flies like this. I'm just going to kind of Manipulate it around, pull it back a little bit to, to get the head shape that I want before I start to cure it. And once I get that, I'll hit it with the light.
put a final trim on it. And so there is a mini bunny bait fish fly. Good for just about anything that's, uh, that's traveling in school. School bass, speckled trout, white bass. Takes a couple of minutes to build and makes a good looking fly. 